the fully geek. What's happening, people? Welcome to 185 episode Fully Geek Pod. I'm your host today because Nate's, Nate's away on holiday. I had it went Turkey car. Um, which is Juju's working in it. So a couple of dreads are dropping out. Boy. <laughs> it's on Turkey for straight repair. I fully, forgot, I fully forgot where it was, isn't it? That's why I didn't bother asking. Like, yeah, yeah, enjoy your holiday, man. Enjoy, enjoy. It, I think, it? I think it's, I think it's Grand Canaria. I think something like that. Yeah, probably. Or Greece. Yeah. One of them. Yeah. But yeah, yeah man, 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 man's out there. Greece. Yeah, all, all good, good man. man. All good, all yeah. good. Jinx wanted chilling. free touch wood. Do you remember that? What's that? Jinx wanted free touch wood. No, no, I never heard that, man. What? No, don't, don't what? worry. Like, like, Jinx touch wood, one, two, three. Yeah, yeah, we don't know. West, we don't know right. I'm with you, Carl. No, 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 Rich, Rich, no, Rich knows it. Rich, Rich knows it. Comply, comply, comply. comply. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I support Merv. I support Merv. Who is good at? Yeah, man. Uh, what's, what's been going on? How was the well? How is the break still going on? Isn't it? It's like, it's like... The break, Easter, isn't it? Oh, Easter, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yes, it's annoying, man. The kids are about in it, so there's money coming out the pocket, trying to find things for them to do. <sighs> they still have kids, it'll be fun, but yeah, what was it? Too, too, mu- too much eggs, man. Too much eggs was sure sick for your chocolate, man. I don't even do the egg business, man, for, for various reasons, but yeah. Wait, so you didn't get the kids any eggs? Nope. I didn't. My guy, my guy. Right, so, <laughs> so no, see, see, this, see, this is the thing, right? He's a chief. But you know what the thing is? No, no, like, no, no. I, I felt bad. No, wait, wait. I felt bad. Because he's like, he was, he, cause my little one was like, raw. Dad, when are we going to do the, the, uh, when are we gonna do the egg, uh, Easter egg chase? Or Easter, Easter, yeah, Easter egg hunt. I was like, oh, yeah, we don't worry, we'll do it. We'll do it soon. Every day. When, when, when? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't worry, we'll do it. Man just gave up asking me, boy. I was just like, nah, nah. When you get older, I'll explain to you, son. So did you, you know, did he did he I, get any Easter eggs? That's the question. No, he got Easter. No, he got Easter eggs from the grandma. You get me, and people that from everyone else, yeah, passed by, yeah, but not me. Yeah, I never did. It, did it, any of you do Easter egg hunt when you're little? Because I never did it. Nah, I never. Nah, I never did it. I never done it. Nah. It's only now, you know, I'm doing it. Well, I'm not even doing. It. I'm doing it with my kids in it, but I'm like, I'm not, this was pretty new to me. Like, but you man never did it in primary school. Oh, nah. I thought yeah, that nah. was on TV stuff, bro. Me, Trust right? me. <laughs> did you, I probably might have done it in primary school. I can't remember. Yeah, if I did, I can't remember. Yeah, but I, yeah, I don't remember it, doing it. I don't remember doing it at all. Yeah, you didn't do it at home. Yeah, yeah we definitely did it at home, boy. Mm. But that's to go and go and find the rice. <laughs> go go and find the remote. The remote control. Toilet, yeah, <laughs> that's, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> go and go and wash the rice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, cool, man. All right, yeah. So other than that, let's get let's get down to it in it. So, weekly roundup. Obviously, like balls on the cards. I'm not thinking about football. So <laughs> <laughs> you might take no, it away, no, innit? No, we gotta touch, we gotta touch football, man. Yeah, yeah, it, was, yeah. it was a big weekend, it was a big weekend, right? Massive. Obviously, right. Arsenal. Other other league leaguers at the moment, you get me. So we we, we faced Liverpool, who were like went to their their ground, which is like a fortress basically. Like no one beats them at Anfield. Obviously, they've lost this season to Leeds, but like usually you go there, you get peppered. Like the past Bandit. the past ten seasons, we've been getting battered there. Every time we go there, we get battered, didn't it? Hmm. So we went there. Yeah, I, I was less hoping for at least a draw. I, that's what I was hoping for when the, when the game kicked off. Like, come on, guys. Let's just try. Oh, keep the keep the score respectable because usually it's a 4 0, 5 0 thing when we go there. So I just thought this is a show that we're, 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 we're challenging for the title team. You get me? And not embarrass ourselves. Hmm. But within the first uh, 30 minutes, we're like 2 0 up. You know what I mean? So everyone's happy. You get me? If, if it's going well. And then um, I see, Rich, I don't know about your opinion yet, but no, I don't really feel... I'm not feeling that, that blaming Shaka business. Yeah. But so basically, can't. people say like Anfield, because I, I ain't going to lie to you, before that incident, so basically Anfield's a place where if the crowd get on your case, yeah, it, the players is turning some some hoax, some mini hoax on the, on the field. 
and like they, they destroy you in it. So because we were winning two 0 not only winning, we were dominating them. Pause. But like we were like controlling <laughs> the game. Yeah, the crowd was so subdued, so quiet. I've never hit ever Absolutely. so quiet in my life. It was so quiet. So obviously, it's the happen where there's a bit of a, a shove and a push from one of the Arsenal players to the to the Liverpool player, and the crowd just reacted. Do you know what I mean? Like what? What? So that uh, then the crowd just started singing their songs and start getting on Arsenal's back. And then the, before I knew, before I knew it, but Liverpool just back in the game, and then came back before half time two one, and then and then we'll hold. And then the second half, bro. I don't. Think, we could have string a pass together, Rich. Bro, we were under it. The way Liverpool came to uh, pepper our goal, wave after wave of attack, and it's like Arsenal were just like, it's like you man, what, what do you man do in this situation? Because like, you know what it is, yeah. Arsenal, but Arsenal been playing everyone. No one's has put us under so much pressure nah. before like this. No, nah. and it was a constant wave of attack. Liverpool have. Randomly, obviously, the incident w- which um, Kel Shaka, touched on yeah. about Shaka is like it ignited the fans and the players. So it was overbearing, you know, the chance and the players were just, were just, it felt like there was something's happened at half time and they were told to come out and just give you all this is for, this is for, this is their FA Cup final or, or of some sort. Yeah. Yeah. And literally, just came back into the game, and w- what changed the game as well. I think that incident with Shaka, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say it's Shaka's fault because end of the day, it's kind of like. But he's a grown man, though. You're yeah. you're a senior member of the team. Why are you reacting, bro? No, but, but you, he, this is he's the kind of player he is, right? I wouldn't expect Marlon to be um, a quiet demeanor individual. He's not that kind of person. If something, if feels something's wrong, he's gonna react. He's gonna say like, "What were you talking about?" And at the same time, you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't change the. Yes, change, I've seen the managers. Go on, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but do you know what I'm saying? You can't change him, even yeah. though he's changed as a person in his football ability and it's fantastic. But he's still got that bite about him, and that's what we love about him. Do you get what I mean? He's, yes, he's, but not an though. Love you, man. Love you, man. Love you, man. <laughs> but I, I, I get that. I get that because obviously last season Arteta. Had a similar thing with um, Klopp, and exactly. Then, and then the crowd went mad. Exactly. And everybody else went mad. Yeah, it's difficult. But look, the thing is, but the thing is, the, the defending for that goal was awful as well. The defending, which one? Was, which the one? first goal, the, 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 the goal, goal they scored. Yeah, for half time, yeah. it was it was awful defending. So yeah, the, the crowd was up for it, but we just, we just, I don't know. It's like we just became boys. It's like we were men. Control the game, yeah. and we became boys like, like I don't know, like a youth team, and we just got shook. Yeah, and um, I, I agree. But the, the only thing I would say, I think I did, I did think Arteta took long to take off Sinchenko. Hundred percent, hundred percent. Because I was, I was calling. I said to myself, "Who's it going to take off?" And I thought, "Teeny's in." I thought you have to bring on Teeny, but you have to bring him, bring him on now. And it yeah. seemed like he didn't have a space in moment in time. The time because it was wave after wave after wave. I don't know. Being a manager, you must be consumed or lost in there. And moment. I want, and I want to put on was it was it Kukov? Kukov. Kukov. I wouldn't put him on because he this is his first Premiership Liverpool game at I Anfield. I know. No, no, no. You bring him on in a game like Southampton or something like that, bro. Jorginho's there. Jorginho's experienced. He knows I, what I, I, I would have personally brought on Jorginho. I don't understand why he brought yeah, like because he I came on straight, he, 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 he caused a foul and it almost led to a goal. Yeah, because Liverpool Liverpool went to a two in midfield and four yeah. up front. Yeah, you, bro. It would have made sense if you bring Jorginho, Shaka, and, and, yeah. and, um, and Partey, and then they were kind of with a semi boss in the midfield. But yeah. look, but look, to be fair, do you know what's funny? Because it fe- it actually felt that we lost the game. It did, it did, it did. Because, like yeah, because we were, we were front for so long, and then the way we got battered in the second half. It just felt, it, you know, it, it felt like we should have won the game, and it also felt like we could have lost the game. Yeah, it it, it yeah. was simply a game of two halves, and you know yeah. what? As a neutral fan, I didn't feel it right, but I had, I had people texting me said, "This is the best game I've ever seen." I like, know, I know. <laughs> at, at the time, I was just like, I, I didn't enjoy that game one bit, bro. You know, I didn't it enjoy is. that game, man. Because I, I was I was at home, I had I had family around, so we had Sunday dinner and stuff like that. Like on God Day, you know. 
on the, 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 the rise of, of Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The, the resurrection of Jesus Christ. And and this kind of game was on. Uh, it was emotional. I was sweating. I was like, people don't talk to me. Individuals Trust don't me. talk to me. But look, it was a good it was a good game. We didn't lose the game. We've That's got, the thing. And we've got all to play for. Bring on West Ham. And the funny thing is, like, is in both our hands now. That's literally. You know what I mean, we win on our games. We, we've got it. They win on their games. We've got it. Got it. However, it's more in our hands in the, in the sense of all we can, all we have to do is draw at their ground. If we draw at their ground, but they have to win. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. They have to beat us. But if we draw, we still we're still cool. Do you know what I mean? I'm scared of them. Big brother, because they're now city. This is the city that we've known. Like the last four or five games, this is city. You get me? And so they yeah, destroyed yeah. by Munich just now three nil. Bro, it's different. It's different gravy, bro. Different power. They got they got the powers, bro. But yeah, but yeah, big up Arsenal. We're all the way, man. We're gonna ride Come it, on. ride it to the end of the season. Eight Come games on. to go. Eight finals to go. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Thanks for the update, gents. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our weekly dose of flea. Um, yeah. So what's going on with um, KSI? Like, I heard he's been doing the rounds, <laughs> oh, making yeah. apologies. Visiting yeah. Moss and stuff, but... yeah. So obviously last week we mentioned about him saying the p word on, on his um YouTube channel and whatnot, and um obviously he had a backlash of everyone just gunning for him basically. Yeah. So he, I think he first went to a mosque to apologize to the people in the mosque and the, and the people of that society. Yeah. Um, and they showed him around the mosque and what they do in the mosque and blah blah blah. Then he went to a Sikh community, and then. It, uh, basically the same for the Sikh community obviously he went to apologize to them and their community and they showed them around the whole uh, what's the Sikh uh, temple called Gudwa is it Gudwa Gudwa yeah yeah Gudwa yeah so he showed them the Gudwa and stuff and what they do what they're about and stuff I don't think he's been to any Hindu temple I don't know mm. but like he's, he's, he's going around still trying you know uncancel himself yeah he gets cancelled trust me because I mean, there's a lot. Of, he, he's got a lot of like a lot of things invested in him, like in regards to prime and do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. So he has to try and resolve the issue quick. Do you know what I mean? So that, you know, yeah. I, I actually commend him for going out and doing that on the back of what he said. Obviously, he, he's probably been advised. <laughs> you got to do this kind of stuff from tomorrow. Not advised, told, like, bro. Yeah, told. Told. You've got you've got to do this stuff from tomorrow. Yeah, Straight, you said it. Now you go and go and do it. And it, and I, I respect him for doing that. You know, obviously re-educating himself and and you know you, this kind of things you can't be doing, especially when you're someone someone who is a he's a face. Fan. He's a face yeah. of YouTube, man. You from the, I mean? the beginning of YouTube, when it was when we didn't care about YouTube, yeah, because there was hardly anything on there for us. Yeah, he was doing his games and all that kind of stuff. So. He he those those what do they call them? Side not side men. Side men? Yeah, side men. Yeah. 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 Those guys, they're all they're all they're the birth of YouTube. So yeah, like yeah, it makes sense what he done. And yeah, I big him up for that, man. He just it just hopefully this obviously helps his knowledge and everyone else's knowledge on the back of saying stuff like that. Cause you you, you literally can't do that kind of stuff. Do you get what yeah. I mean? Mm-hmm. And how and how fast you could just lose your career. Oh yeah, you know, yeah. And stuff like that, man. So yeah, guys, man, just just use your brain. Just use your brain, man. You know what's right. You know what's wrong, bro. Just be careful. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Cool. Oh yeah, cool. You're putting something about Madeline McCann, like. Oh but, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What was? Okay. Yeah, because obviously, um, Rich um, brought it to our attention a, a few months back. Was it? Yeah. That how there's a there's a there's a young lady claiming to be Madeline McCann. Yeah. You know I mean. Oh, and, yeah. I remember um, that, yeah. Yeah, she set up her Instagram page and all sorts. And she goes, listen, I, she, to be honest, she, she never said, it's me, but she she believed it was her. And all yeah. she was a DNA test. Like, just give me a DNA test. If it's on me, cool. Do you know what I mean? So I think, obviously, behind the scenes, we didn't hear from the camp parents, did we? Like, we didn't hear from them at all. No, I, I haven't no. seen anything from the camp parents yeah. directly, no. So, basically, they, they, they got an official DNA test, and she's not the one. She, she, I mean, she's not um, Madeline. She, it's not her. So, um... Yeah, I'm like I can imagine the parents, you know, what I mean, like thinking, although they didn't come out and say something, but come on, the, the, there must be a glimmer of hope that yeah. it could be heard. You know what I mean? So, so you think that's why it's a little bit 
out of order that they bring all this to the news before. Why, why, if this girl came out and said, "I think I'm her DNA," why, why bring it on? Why is it on the news and everything? Why not just do the DNA and then announce the results? Why make the whole world be like, "Oh, it might be her"? Like, no, I mean, dad would have seen this. I, I don't think. Just, it, like, I don't think it, 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 it I don't think it came it didn't go into the news it was more into social media world okay it was it was just Instagram oh, yeah. um Twitter that's the world it was in but I saw it on like I think it did come on the news it did it did it did, it did make the news definitely it made it, did it? Mm-hmm. yeah yeah it made the news yeah like, do your research first innit? it don't get everyone's hopes up like imagine that the parents seeing that like this girl's come forward could be her well, don't bring that on the news for anyone to see. Do the DNA test, and then maybe if you want to have a story, this girl came out claiming to be Madeline, but we did a DNA, not her. That's I don't, I don't know. Maybe I've just in it, man. Like the internet is on force right now. Crazy. Trust, Trust me. me. Trust I, I, I don't know if you guys. <laughs> I'm, I don't know why I'm laughing. Did you guys see the the Dalai Lama, um, um Buddhist priest, um, Buddhist spiritual uh, leader? Yeah, I saw that. No, man. I'm happy. Listen, oh, this, spi- this, this spiritual leader called um, Dalai Lama, right, kisses a boy and tells the boy, suck his tongue. What, 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 are you okay or something? What, what are you doing? Imagine, Nation- on national TV. On national was, there, TV. Was, there, was there some rationale behind that? No rationale. Like- no mm-hmm. rationale, bro. Very concerning Can video. Any rationale behind that? Well, well. I, I don't know. I don't know. Like, yeah, I'm not, not to judge it, it. Like, it's, it's, is it some sort of tradition? I don't know. I've read it. Yeah. So, so, I, so I think it, it was a, a sense of it was a meet and greet, and there was like kids meeting in different spiritual Buddhist spiritual leaders. Yeah. And um, and this particular kid lent in and, and kissed him, and yeah. and the man was like saying, "Oh, okay, I'm not." He didn't really say that. And it goes to him, you know. Yeah, this is how remix is talking. It, it, it needs to see him. It to him oh, you, you can suck my tongue. And the camera zoomed in and he see me he say, suck my tongue. And the boy went in to suck his tongue. And then 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 the camera spanned away and the boy boy walked off. And he, he's come out and apologized and said, um, I, I'm deeply sorry for what I done. Um oh, so, uh... Sorry? Wrong, no, he knows, he knows it's wrong, then, like basically what he's done was inappropriate. I, I don't know if he knows it's wrong or he's yeah. got away with it for so long. And then so it goes, Bro, because Thank the cameras you. were the cameras you, there this time, like you, you've been caught. You get me? Yeah, Matt, it was a, uh, honestly, and when I saw that, I was like, Am I, am I seeing it right? What's going on? <laughs> it, to me, it doesn't make any sense what he's doing. And, and it's very concerning from my perspective. That mm-hmm. was my child. I, I was like, What's going on? Spiritual yeah. leader, not spiritual leader, bro. I don't care. Someone's yeah. got to get hurt. Yeah. yeah. Well, okay. So we had the um, RIP, RIP, if I should say, last week. Yeah. More from Ben. Um, he was found dead unexpectedly in, like, last Thursday, innit? Like, Who? Who, yeah. sorry? Paul Casimir from S Club 7. Yeah, that S Club. Yeah. Ain't no point like an S Club party. Yeah, age, age 46 oh. as well. So, proper young man. But yeah. do we know what he died of? Because it was said it's like it was just unannounced, isn't it? Like, well, yeah, I don't think I don't think it's come out yet. I don't think it's come out what, what actually yeah. happened. Um, because yeah. that, that was deep because it's only a week before, yeah, they kind of got back together, isn't it? Yeah, because yeah. yeah. that's that's why. I, it was a bigger shock for everyone because they came out to announce that, oh, listen, we're going to do a tour. We're going to do like a last tour around the UK, blah, blah, blah. Buy your tickets and all that. Do you know what I mean? And then well, they did well, a week after. Going to be involved as well. All of them. All, all of them, them, yeah. That's probably rare. It's probably rare for like a reunion that every, yeah, and, and there's seven of them as well, you know. So it's Proper. like, yeah. And Bradley was one, two hip hop lines. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, club, but you know, RIP to Paul, man. Yeah, um, man. So, obviously, back in, when it came out, obviously, like, I had to show them no love in it because man can't say that. We were at that age where it's like, no, we don't listen to this music. Exactly. Man. Yeah, secretly, secretly. You just but you know, the to thing it. is, it's not secret, yeah. it's that you can't escape it. It's everywhere you go. True, so yeah, you, you, need, you, need this, you need the songs. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. In it, Ma. I don't get it. You can check the web for. Man said in it, Ma, you know. One more, Kel. I remember. So I don't. I can't off the top of my head think of a song. Right, let's, let's sing one for Paul. I told you. S I know. Club. I heard that one. Give me another one. 
There's a there's more catchier ones in that. I I'm I'm with you. I just can't remember any. I can't. I can't I'm actually trying to think of. I can't think yeah. of any titles. That's what we do. But the things well, when I hear it though, I'll, I'll be able to sing yeah, along. Yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. can't know more than that. Mm, not very good then, are they? <laughs> Oh gosh! Yeah, but bro, quick, I know, I know. This, 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 this something quick, um, Murph. Hmm. Sorry, but did you man hear about um, Russia, China, India, uh, South Africa coming together to form their own currency, and it's it's going ahead? You know, serious? Yeah, yeah bro. Then they were no longer trading the US dollar. Yeah, no US dollars, which it's going to sort of impact the US dollar heavily. The yeah, Western but... world is going to impact the Western world heavily. This is what Gaddafi originally suggested in the right, first place. Right, right, Rich. Thank you, my brother. This is what Gaddafi was trying to do in Africa. He's trying to say, Africa, let's unite, use one currency, not spend any European Western world currency, and watch they come flock, watch they come flocking to us. But they killed him for that reason. But they can't do that. But they can't kill the Russians, boy. They, they can't kill the Chinese. <laughs> There's no way they can do that. Do you know what I mean? So <laughs> they, they're stuck. Stop. You know, <laughs> you know what I mean? I, I'm laughing, yeah, because you know what? Because they're the biggest forces, isn't it? Trust they're, me. Out of that westernized world that we call, they're like they're the biggest force, China and Russia. And it's just like you get those guys together, you know you've got problems. You got problems. You got problems. China and Russia uniting. I don't know. I don't know if they're gonna make a new currency or they're gonna use um one of their currencies only. Mm-hmm. But basically they're 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 forming a little crew. And yeah, it's it's gonna put the Western world's economy in trouble. Trust me, it's oh, gonna yeah. be it's gonna be get down or lay down. You get me? Obviously, yeah. you, you man are forgetting certain things. Yeah, hey, go through, go through, Mars. Educate, know, educate saying, us, educate you know us. How it's been, bro? I've been telling you like this for a couple of years now. China and Russia are gonna get together, and it's gonna destroy America. Blah blah blah. Like you just said, the Gaddafi thing. But he was his his thing was it was backed by the oil. I mean, sorry, the gold. That gold. Was yeah, their, their currency may, meant something, so that would have literally destroyed everyone. But yeah, this has been coming for a long time. Like I was, I was, there was something in the news where they were talking about how China's not saying anything about the war between Russia and Ukraine, and China's like, "Don't tell us how to deal with Russia. That that's our people," kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, it's, it's gonna get saucy soon. It's gonna get real saucy. Trust me. Yeah, but, but however, you know, like. The fact that they won't use the US dollar fundamentally that would, that would affect us eventually, right? No, the whole West. That's what I mean. The whole Western world would be impacted, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm. big time, man. and uh, and that's what the Russians and Chinese want. Every empire falls, yeah. Just trust me, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, Greece fell. They all fall eventually. It might be America's time to fall. That's what we know. Straight. Yeah, we'll come back to Ghana. <laughs> I'm coming with you. I was taking this originally. Straight. Jeez. Marlo, you got to do, you got, you got to do um, Me 23, you know, to find out your DNA. I, I, I want to, I'm going to, I want to. I'm scared yeah, that I'm more European than anything. <laughs> you are 61%. It's going to say it's broken, it's broken, man. It broke. It's just not inconclusive. <laughs> inconclusive. <laughs> Unidentif- <laughs> unidentified frigging species, boy. <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine if it come back as like no origin of this world, isn't it? Do you know what? I'll cry and, and fireball be at his door, front door. This is why you're so different. Mm-hmm. Trust and me, Area, f- Area 51, all over your gap. We have come to collect you all. <laughs> and everything will make sense. Everything will make sense. You know, you, you know just people are making up things. Oh, yeah, that's why Marlon never... Oh, yeah, that's why we never saw Marlon. Oh, yeah, that's why... Get me. That's um, why he never put on weight. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> well, to take it there, you know. Man, man will go back and show you that picture from our. Uh, I've got it um, here, Rick Wheaton, bro. I said that picture, bro. I said that picture. <laughs> <laughs> you see a man that's bigger there, yeah? Boy, it's yeah. come back, come back. Stress is over, man. Stress is yes. over. Come on. Right, all right, right. So, um, Star Wars celebration, man. Star Wars. Over the weekend. And first well, of all, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, you, you get excited to say it's Star Wars celebration. Did you even know it was Star Wars celebration? Well, can, can I tell my story? Yeah, yeah. Can tell I tell you, my go, story go on my behalf, <laughs> innit? I didn't ask for a sister. Yeah. Damn. Go for it, sir. I knew it was happening, but for some reason, I didn't know where the location was. Like, like the internet just blocked my location or something. Do don't really try mean? it. Don't try it, bro. Man, man was out chasing toads. I'm, I'm man, man was out chasing, chasing toads in his garden, bro. 
and cooking them. <laughs> why am I why am I cooking toad, bro? Bro, toad it's legs, man? Do you know what's uh, funny? I just saw something on Instagram. I don't know what it's because of your toad, but I yeah. saw some I saw some place cooking toads and frogs. Like fully, I just no, like, I like, like fully thought they were frogs, you know, until I correct them, innit? <laughs> Come on, you know, you know I'm that guy in it. <laughs> it's true though, because I can't fight even, can't even okay, bet yeah. against Cobra, the animal guy, bro. <laughs> Yeah, man. But can't, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm upset. Like, even, even if I couldn't get a ticket, I would have just driven up there and waited outside, bro. <laughs> yeah, but um, yeah, that happened. Mm-hmm. And like all these announcements of um, what's coming up. So like we've got three new Star Wars movies. Um, mm-hmm. one from David Mangold, who done Logan movie. Um, Dave Filoni, which is basically. He's probably like the Kevin Feige of Snow. He's not the Kevin Feige of Star Wars, but he, he's created a lot of stuff in, it, in, in Star Wars, like all that and Ahsoka. Um, and what's it? And Sharmim obeyed, you know, if I'm correct to um, put that name wrong. So, yeah, three, three movies. Um, and, of, and what's the name? Daisy Ridley's return as Ray in a new um, movie after the rise of Sky. Um, I, I, beg you, I beg you break it all down. Like, so, this brilliant. Bring, bring, do a mini breakdown of all these films coming out and what what time they fit in and do you know what I mean? Don't. So from what I know, so go on, Omar. No, I just I just feel like Star Wars is dead since they all this new stuff with Ray and the whole return. Of, what was the last one? The Rise um, of Skywalker. Skywalker. Nah, I yeah, I didn't I didn't like yeah. Like, I'm gonna say right? last week. I didn't Wars, like not Star Wars. It's not. I didn't like the last three. The last three, I, I don't like them. But I think. I don't know what they're going to be doing the Ray, like race character. She's going to be um, a master Jedi. Well, I'll know it. She should be, like, she should be, be like, to be fair. Be like um, fifteen years in the future, she's going to be a master Jedi. It's just weird, like. Oh, See, I don't, I don't mind that because that makes sense. Because yeah, everyone, just, the backlash do, of Ray, no one cares yeah. for Ray. Everyone kind of wished she would just go away and bring Star Wars back to what Star Wars is. No one. Do you know what? Ray. Like, let's be you real. know, it's not that they don't care about. No, I'm all, I'm all. I'm Luke's, all, Luke's whole. I'm all happy that away. they've. Yeah, but you know, it is. Yeah, it's good that they've made new characters for Star Wars because obviously, like Luke, Luke Skywalker is going to get old. Well, he, he should be old anyway. Do you know what I mean? It's been thirty years since the thirty years since the um, uh, Return of the Jedi. But you know, it is. I think they just made Rey too flawless, and that's why everyone's upset about. She she didn't really go through any kind of struggle and. I think people preferred that she was just a nobody, but they had to somehow tie her into like Emperor Palpatine and make them related. Like I think I think the mystery of her just being a nobody and and, and she was strong with the force. But they just they just made her a bit unstoppable, innit? it? Like she had no flaws where Luke and Anakin had to go through proper Bro, one day she, there, she like... didn't know how to use the force. The next day, you remember when she like opened the, the, oh, rocks, yeah, the... the rocks? In the air, like yeah. Luke couldn't do that for years when he tried to lift the the X wing. She's doing this the next day. She don't come from nothing, uh, bro. Come on, like they just do it again. Sorry, this whole girl power. Look, let's make the girls strongest. They'll be better than the men. They'll take over us. That's what the MCU Hulk woman. <laughs> I, I, hey. No, but, no, that's what I, I don't have a problem with her, with her being a girl. I don't have a problem. With no, her I know being why. I just, they just, I, I just think it's just they they just stun it a bit. They just kind of rock. They didn't right? flesh out her character too well. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, but but even apart from the whole, the rest of the whole thing is awful. Like the last one. But yeah, anyway. So I think they're doing like a old Republican thing as well. Movie like um, the beginning of the Jedi, how they came about. So that would be sick. That'd be yeah, that, that that'd be good. Yeah, in theory. Um, yeah, in theory. Um, I think they are doing. They're doing a Mandalorian film as well, and Dave Filoni is going to direct that. So that's going to be his first. Direct and live action. Direct. Merv, just, just to confirm, yeah. the Mandalores, yeah, yeah, they 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 they're, they're normal humans, but just they they're highly skilled and they wear they wear the strongest armor. Is that all it is? Yeah, Ves- Veska, yeah, yeah. So like, so yeah, go on. Yeah, no, go on. What was gonna say? No, so and and people hire them for bounty. Huh? Yeah, bounty, yeah. yeah. They're basically, yeah, they're like basically a bounty hunter. Like they're just um, yeah, and they had, they had a whole planet to themselves, or it was just yeah, like, like a little. Yeah. Um, can yeah, I just man. say they're not Mandalores? They come from Mandalore. So what what do they call them? Mandalorians, Mandalorians. Mandalor- yeah. Mandalor- oh, Mandalorians. Yeah, yeah, Mandalorians. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm used to yeah. the game, Marlon. I'm loud, man. Oh, that's, cool. no, game. that's why I yeah. said it all nicely, bro. You know, I love it. Yeah. yeah. So, you, so sorry, just to interrupt you there yeah. as well. So obviously, I'm watching Rebels now. Yeah. Yeah. Why did why did why okay don't okay I'm gonna say don't spoil it for me because I'm on season two. Okay. 
That's all right. Why? <laughs> yeah, I've got to say, why yeah. did they... Con- but Rebels, the Rebels come out before the whole new... Um, the whole... The, 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 these new ones that come out, the Rebels come out yeah. before that. Yeah. Came, so why did this... They should just continue the story from that. Do you know what I mean? I know, that's... Because that, yeah. that, that, that young boy... What, hmm. what's his name? Ezra. 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 Yeah. Get me, it should, it should have been him. It's the Ray, do you know what I mean? True. But remember, oh, I can't even say this thing. Yeah, 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 that's what I mean, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, 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 whoa, well, that's close. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, Rebels are sick, though. Like, yeah, Rebels really, are sick, I love anim- Rebels. I prefer Clone Wars animation style. But you know what it is? Like- it's God, it's God in the Galaxies. That's what it is. It's God, God in the Galaxies. Yeah, yeah, the, I like yeah. the storyline, sick. Like, yeah. Um, yeah, so you Rebels. I've seen, mm, I've seen a few, I've seen a few of Bad Batch Rebels, but they're good. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. I just like I said, no Nate um, Merv's gonna go at me, but I just don't feel like it's needed. Like you just said, that person who should have been the Ray. It's not. I lo- It's not really canon, is it? It is, but oh, it, it is. is. It's like how long they, the seasons go on for. Like they have their own stories within it. So they are kind of canon because yeah, they, they, they they went alongside with the main Star um Star Wars like the yeah. ones that we're used to. It went alongside of them. It's all the stuff afterwards, like fake, like all the stuff with Ray and all that stuff. That's just like. I don't know, I don't know what they were thinking with those ones, because it, at least because I don't, I don't know if you recognise because when you're watching Clone Wars, like see what they do, like all the sixty six, so they're doing things yeah. from different perspectives. So like obviously when we watch um, and Anakin was killing all the all the Jedi, like and all, was, well, we saw it from yeah we did, we saw it from a different angle in in Clone Wars, didn't it? So it's all connect like it's just basically a different story like within the same. Well, yeah, yeah, different like, story, but no, they're doing the so I don't know if any of you guys watched the Ahsoka yeah, trailer. Massive. Yeah, nah, I did. Yes. Yeah, I watched the trailer. Yeah, I watched the trailer. Yeah. I, sorry, the the Ahsoka in Rebels is not the same voice that's in the Clone Wars, isn't it? It's different. Because I've noticed that. I don't know. I'm sure. Maybe because she's a bit older. Because she's supposed to be older in Rebels. Yeah, yeah. Unless, of course, she... I, I, don't, I don't know. I have to fact check that. But, but, yeah. yeah, it's it, it seems different. The vibe, her vibe is all different. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Maybe, maybe it's different. Yeah. Um, what else did they put? Yeah, they obviously they announced Skeleton Crew and um, the... Is that Pop Stuff like that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, the one... Yeah, man. I, I just hope whatever they do, it's good, isn't it? And it, I think they're doing... It's, like it's not going to be good. It's not going to be good, bro. Well, I don't, do you know what? I don't know, because it's... These look, these ones seem more connected to what we're used to, like the Clone Wars. Like it's, it's just the new stuff that I don't like. The last three Star Wars weren't good. Everything else before that, I think, has been good. Rogue One, um, even Solo was good. It wasn't it wasn't a money maker, but it was decent. Mm. Do you know what I mean? So let's let's hope that um, I'm true, man. Right? So yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I, I haven't watched Andor yet, but I watched one episode. Yeah. Is, so is Andor before all of them, isn't it? So Andor's before yeah, Andor's before Rogue One, which is which is essentially okay. before A New Hope. Like you know the one where we first see Luke Skywalker. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. It's really, yeah, yeah, so it's, be, it's before that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. okay, okay. I personally yeah. think I don't know if this is relevant, but Rogue One was pretty sick to me. I don't know. Yeah, no, I liked Rogue One. Yeah, Rogue One was sick. Like like that ending, I didn't expect it to be the beginning of A New Hope. Yeah, yeah, that was... was, was, And that's, again, I'm not... I don't mean to harp on the same thing, but that's, again, why if you watch A New Hope first and then watch that, like, it's like an M. Shalaman, whatever his name is, sorry. Yeah. It's like a little twist. Like, you don't expect it to be, like, the exact moment before... Yeah. Like, pretty sick. Yeah, no, it's, it's... Star Wars movie wise, in my opinion. Yeah, 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 man. So that's that's Star Wars celebration, right? Um, did you guys see the new trailer for the Marvels? Yes, I did. Yes. I did. Oh, you I did, did. Yeah, you did, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. I enjoy. I enjoy, I enjoyed it. It looks interesting. Yeah, yeah, it looked good, man. It looked good. And the only reason why I, you know I don't usually, I don't usually watch Marvel trailers, but because it's um I thought that, what's the young lady called Miss Marvel. Um, yeah, I don't care for it. Innit? You know, you know, I hate the her, her song. Oh, well, the Kamala Khan character. Yeah, I, I hate this. Yeah. yeah, I hate it. So I thought I'm just watching. I don't care for it. Innit? Yeah, but no, but the, the way they put, I like it. The, I like it. It looks good. It looks good. Yeah, it looks so good. Like they're, yeah. They're all intertwined, and I, I, I love that. I love that. Yeah, yeah. I just, yes. uh, sorry. No, go on, go on. 
Now, I, I know um, <laughs> Marlo mentioned about the whole girl power thing, but I actually think this actually works. I think it, it, it will work. Um, there's all connections between them in general from when we saw Scott. Is it Scott, she was in, what's the black girl's name? Yeah, um, she's she's in one division. Um, one division. One division. She was in yeah, one division. Yeah. That's yeah. it. So you know, we 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 we're gonna see everything. So I'm I'm happy about this, but yeah. I was I'm actually pretty surprised this this is, was even being made. I, I had no idea. Yeah, I didn't have no idea. Yeah, coming together. That's in a personal while Sorry, that page. A person our page, isn't it? Our our, our Insta page a while ago. <laughs> Have you not seen? I don't. Yeah. Seen yeah. The, um, trailer for the new Indiana Jones. <laughs> nah. I, I know it's out, but I didn't want to watch it because it's the final trailer, isn't it? Yeah. But so listen, I think I've seen too much thing. already. No, so, how, this is our childhood, yeah. Indiana Jones has always been the hero. He's always been the guy. Watch. Mark my words, yeah. Remember if everything I've been saying about. I'm not going to spoil it for anyone, but watch yeah. what they do to India. They already graped him in the Crystal Skull. What yeah. should they do to him in this film? What's what they do? What are they gonna do? What are they gonna do? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not I want. Well, you, I want it, to be it's in the films. They can't be spoilers, is it? What's your predictions? What's your predictions? What she's gonna? They's, they're gonna wipe him out. Yeah. And they're gonna make a woman the the hero of it all. Watch. Bro, my, bro, my, bro, let, let it out, man. What's, what's your what's your beef with women, bro? I love women. My beef ain't with women. I just said to you. Remember all our memories of Indiana Jones from being a child. He's the savior, the savior, the savior. This whole new world we're in now i'm just guaranteeing he won't be the savior anymore that's what i'm saying just like every other thing they're doing it's just changing neo matrix i mean look look what they even did to our brother the hulk this is the hulk look what they did to him man's doing the... yoga he's all happy D- bro don't mess me about it. he's the hulk you understand <laughs> what the hulk represents well he's professor hulk man it says he's got yeah, some, no i agree, I agree. Look, you, know, you know me and the hulk you know my feelings of hulk man Bruce Banner's Wait. the cool guy. Bruce Banner's the one with the. They've destroyed him. They've destroyed him. But, but in, the, in the comics from, from not, back in the 80s, man, 80s has been like. It's been the, Hulk, the, whole the whole time, point of it? the Hulk is the masculine anger. That's why he's David Banner or Bruce Banner has to keep it back. Yeah, no, it's, it's evolution, man. They can't, they can't uh, no, no, no. character arc, can they? You can't say the same all the time. Bro. Listen, listen. Uh, it, it, nah, it can nah, be nah, evolution, nah, but he still has to be the physical nah, Hulk. He has to be physical. He has to be Hulk, like, man. Yeah, I, 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 his I name, agree. his name of his Hulk. That's his I'll name, Hulk. This is got a different I mean, name now. Like, even the Incredible name. Hulk. Come on, don't do this to. Look, look. I agree well, that they should be. Even Four said he's not doing it again. If that's how they're gonna make him in Four, he's not doing it again. Like, what's that guy's name? Um, like, Chris on, Hemsworth. Not, I know we like Marvel, but come on, they're taking. No, Chris Hemsworth, I think that's because he, he was diagnosed with some early stages of dementia or some trait of dementia in it or something with Alzheimer's. That's yeah, why like, yeah. taking a break from acting. But I, I um, watched him say, if this guy is doing another Thor, he's going to seriously consider not doing it because that's not the, that's not the Thor he wants to portray. Like the Thor. No, you know what? It, it's I, I don't it's look. Remember, like they're basing all this stuff off of comic, isn't it? Every so all, all this stuff. Like, Why are we not seeing that? And like it's all. all, all this, I'm, not saying that. I'm not saying all this stuff we don't girl. like. We it's all. It's in the girl. comics, but it's the execution. I think is the problem. That's the execution because I, I do think Hulk should have, like, he should have been a bit more rageful in in Endgame and stuff without right. necessarily being nuts. Do you know what I mean? And like right. I, I like like him being a professor, I have no problem being that. But when it comes to the battlefield, you become a Hulk. You just lose your shit. That's so what I, swear, meant, I swear the worst thing you done was throw. I swear the worst thing you done was throw the bench at, um, when you found out the touch of like that we do. And he was that was meant to be his love interest, you know. <laughs> I can hear me though. Right. <laughs> yeah, I can, I can hear you, man. Uh, no, I'm just, yeah. just like. No, but yeah, think we're, about we're, it. we're just sure. taking one movie. For, let's think about the evolution of what they're doing to each character. Like, it's it's a joke. Oh, they are watering up. The, they are watering. Up. That's why, like, I I wasn't here for the whole Ant Man thing, but I think I'm I'm getting too old for the MCU now. Um, because Ant Man to me was like a it was a joke thing. It was an absolute joke, and yeah, I, it was it was a it was a comedy, and it was, I think that they're watering that watering them the whole thing down now. I, I just can't take it serious no more. Wait you know, until wait. Think, yeah, go. No, ahead, I, I was gonna say wait until you see Shazam. <laughs> that, that's yeah, DC. No, yeah. yeah, that's DC. But Do you yeah. know what? I don't think that we're getting too old. I, I think they're they're losing that magic, man. Do you know what I mean? Because look look, look at all the first stages of the MCU, like all the films. They were they were they were a lot more grounded. 
there wasn't I, I i know the the multiverse is relevant to to, to the mcu and, and dc but they could have just used the multiverse like, i think the multiverse would have been perfect to introduce things like x-men and like even though they tease that in one division with, with quicksilver but it's like they're just games like Mona or something no but, they, they, but they, um, they are introducing x-men x-men they are be- but it would have been good if they'd done it at that point do you know what I mean? Because they already yeah. they already obtained the rights to, to X Men anyway, so it's like I, I think it's just too much multiverse, too much. They don't know what they're doing. Oh, they, now they... I, I think what they're trying to do is rebalance everything, right? And the multiverse is is going to be a, the multiverse section is going to be a lot of a lot of people a lot of people won't like what they're going to do for for a part for maybe for the next five to six years or maybe longer. But then it was it will settle itself down because everything will be balanced. Everybody be out of the whole multiverse world, and, and that chapter would just kind of well, we expect it to close where yeah. the films then then it will kind of break out and the mm. true films will kind of will kind of come out again. Also, yeah. um, oh, shit, that's that's what are you saying? Not under Disney, I know it's hopeful. It's, it's good to be hopeful. Oh, 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 I gotta say, they're under Disney. No, it's not happening. You know, I hear that because. Please just stay away from Blade. Leave. I don't, I don't want to see a Blade film. If it's not R rated, it's Ishmael. It's Ishmael. Ishmael guy, isn't it? Mashal Ali. Mashal Ali, yeah. Mashal Ali. What's it? Ishmael. What's wrong with you? Mercy's nah. first name and second name together, you know, Mashal Ali. <laughs> no, no, but obviously it sounds like oh, Mashal Ali. Salam alaikum. Mashal Ali, yeah. No, but I don't know why I said Ishmael. I don't know why I said Ishmael, by the way. I just assumed, didn't it? It was, it was close enough, anyway. But Blade has already been. They're already starting, Blade. Unfortunately, it's going to be horrendous. It, it, it's going to be R-rated. If it's not R-rated, I'm not interested. That's Look, Giza. You, you guys have seen all the memes that they call this thing the MCU now, right? We've seen that. It's not just me, right? We've all seen it. Yeah, we've seen that a long okay, time. Cool. That's it. Okay, cool, cool. So it's not just me saying this stuff. I don't even know what you said, but it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> no, but no, yeah, um, Blade's I, I, not going to be good. I think the only X-rated thing they're doing or R-rated they're doing at the moment is Deadpool. Oh, yeah. I think that's. I think that. I think because they have to. They, they can't. That's one thing they can't. I think they can get away with. Mm-hmm. They can make it. Look, when you think about some of the MCU, it's still quite violent, you know. Do you know what I mean? So I don't think with Blade, I think they can get away with some violence as long as they. If they, if they're actually gonna, I hope, basically, I hope they don't do a Morbius with Blade, is it? Like, oh, let let me just let me just drink blue blood. <laughs> like anyhow, I swear, I swear that I, I hardly saw that guy bite anyone. You know? Or rip their heads off. Do you know oh. what I mean? Like, yeah. Um, no, looking forward to it, I suppose. There's Samuel Jackson in it as well, by the way. Who? Samuel Jackson in it, Nick Fury. Oh, yeah. I'm yeah. not trying to be taken out, to be fair. <laughs> yeah, man. But anyway, um, I think that's anything else going on? I don't uh, know. We are, we, it, yeah. we are discussing um, Mandalorian. I know Kel just asked about it, but because he's talking about Star Wars, no, we can get we can get into that into the um, yeah, film and TV. okay, yeah, cool, cool, cool. I didn't yeah. know. So let's let's get into the film and TV session, shall we? All right. Do-do. So um, let's start off with our weekly favorite hour. Yes. What episode was this again, Rich? I know it's called episode the four. Of episode yeah, four. Land of, yeah, Land of Opportunity. So, um, what happened in this one? So, yeah, so, obviously, uh, stop. Yeah, go. On. Yeah, so this episode, um, Kane, Tariq, and the and the rest of the crew went to meet. Um, what's that guy's name? Is he a French guy? Or whatever he is. What a- um, the short guy that who who get who, who gave them the guns to go and sell? Yes. Yeah, you remember that. I think, yeah, you know, you know, I think of the British, the black, the black British guy in it for a second. Then, yeah, 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 but I think, yeah, is, is he British? Is no, 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 is it, it wasn't the black guy, the one that's with the, the woman, the, that yeah, the person. British woman. So, so, yeah. so basically, because, um, because, um, obviously, their, their whole thing is about drugs, right? But, yeah. um, but also, the person who's that guy they killed again, is it not Lorenzo? What's his name? Um, uh, Matt- Sorry, Mecca, is it Mecca? Is it Mecca, Mecca? That's it. Yeah, Mecca. Mecca also sold guns at the same time as yeah. well. 
So yeah. one of the, one of, so obviously they had a big box of guns to go and sell, and um, and they were like, "You can't sell guns. This this literally not not what we do." Um, mm. But Mecca did it, so you guys have got to do it. Um, and by the way, until now, we still haven't seen this English woman come back into the show. You know, I don't it's know who okay, she. Bro. <laughs> I don't know who she thinks she Man, is. <laughs> she, came, she came in so strong, yeah. And I'm like, I expect to see you in every episode. Just, Which one? Just, she she was like um. She she was, was she, no she was was she Mecca's wife or fiance yeah. or something Mecca's fiance or yeah yeah she came wife. in the first really? episode yeah yeah well, you've seen her yeah yeah, yeah. you've, 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 you know, you've yeah. seen her we we know I can't I don't know her, her real name but um if you just look up probably season number three in it look up season three the first episode you'll, you'll know exactly what you're talking about but um yeah still waiting for it like well, I don't know she she must come back at some point. Yeah, she'll, she'll definitely come back at some point. Mm. So um, on this episode, they had to go and sell the guns. Um, and they were like, no one no idea had to, who to sell the gun to. So um, Hen's little brother, um, I can't remember his name. Drew. Drew. Um, Drew, yeah. Drew had um, had one of the boys, one of, one of his contacts sold the guns yeah. to some, um, like a, it's like a racist group. But end of the day, they want to get rid of the guns. Yeah, so yeah. part part of their plan was to obviously go and sell the guns. So Kane and Lorenzo went to do the deal. Mm. Deal kind of went rock. Deal what well, the deal went went well. Um, and on the back of the on the back of the deal, um, the, I think, uh, the white guys followed um, followed Braden, um, and the show Braden dro- dropped the money to Kane and um, Lorenzo. And yeah. realizing, obviously, the deal the deal was part of part of Kane and Lorenzo's deal, and yeah. obviously that's when all the guns went off and everyone started firing bullets around, um, and um, yeah, and, and obviously Drew came to save the day because Lorenzo yeah. kind of took charge despite Kane being so called head of the family. Um, yeah. Lorenzo saved um, Kane's life. By pushing him out of the way and shoot, yeah, shoot yeah. killing off the other guy, and and Kane kind of like, yeah, I respect you now, Dad. Yeah, I kind yeah. of respect you. I'll yeah. give you back the power, and I won't say anything to Monet. Yeah. Um, at the same time, which which I which I felt, which I felt, you know, you know when someone's humbled. Yeah. Because because Kane all this time Kane was going on it was it was the big man I'm the bad man I'm taking control of this family but at the same time you didn't ha- you didn't have the brains and despite Lorenzo's your dad isn't he he's been in this game for years despite being in prison or everything else um, and um, he's kind of like giving the power back to his dad now and um, and yeah also and a part of that as well obviously Kane found out that. Um, if he was the one that took out Lauren, or supposedly took out Lauren, yeah, yeah, oh yeah, and he, he um he let he let Ify know that he knows previously in the episode, and um and he goes and during that moment of humbleism, he was being humbled. He, he kind of text Ify and Tatila to, to let, let her know I won't say nothing to Tariq. My secret is safe, but you know, Kane, how long for? That's what I yeah, question. Yeah, kind of yeah. how long for? Um. I don't know if you want to continue with the episode, but um, also in the episode, um, did you, I don't think you, I don't think you realized um, on when when that set where that scene where Lorenzo and Kane and Drew killed those white guys. Yeah. The next day, um, Officer Bl- Blanco, she came to the scene, and there was. A DEA agents, like police agents, right, at a crime scene, and one of the what one of the DEA agents was, um, what's her name? Well, you know they go on from the original one from Power, um, um, Rodriguez. Rodriguez, right? Yeah. What um, one of the guys there was called Rodriguez. That's um, um, that's the brother. Oh, of, is it? Of, yeah. That, of, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. the brother of um, the original Rodriguez, Rodriguez yeah. the love yeah. interest in in power. So eventually he'll come, he'll, he'll get involved eventually. Yeah, yeah. That actually that actually got me quite excited actually. <laughs> Probably didn't quote that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, it, it was big. It was big. Yeah. Um, and also happened in episode 
um, the whole thing with a policeman. And what's his name? Uh, Sullivan. No, not Sullivan. Um, what's his name? I'm going to quickly. I saw what his name. But yeah, the one, the one that was just the one that was going out with um, the or thing is X, isn't it? Um, that's it. That's Rog- it. Professor Morgan's ex. I'm trying to. Get, I'm oh, trying is, to... I saw I had his name down. You know. I can't remember. I don't know why I can't yeah. remember his name. Yeah, but, but he he's just on. He's just on to like no. Yeah, he tried. He he um he propositioned. What's it? Diana, isn't it? The Diana. Well, yeah. Diana. Well, Diana was playing game. Yeah, playing double, game. Yeah, yeah. Double. Because so in this ep- and also part of this episode, you know, there was a family meeting and um yeah, and well, Diana was kind of pushed out of the family meeting, but um, Monet went to visit Diana. And told Diana, I need your help. Basically, yeah. this is the scenario. And basically, I want you to go to the policeman um, and say to him, basically, you know where I'm, I'm against my parents, my family, and I know where to stash all the paperwork and everything else. So this policeman was said, like, really? Are you sure? Yeah. And she, she was like, yeah. Um, they've got a camera. But it's on the side. And the keys under the under the flower pot. But I was thinking to myself, hey, this policeman dumb or something. This, yeah. this, I know he wants um, to heart as bad, but are you really going to break into the house? Am he really broke yeah, into yeah, the house? It was just like, oh, I think she was saying, oh, do you, you need a warrant? And he's like, no, no, I'll just, I'll just get it. I'll just get it. Because like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And he all come, he come into the house, hooded up, had this little light that showed the, ca- I don't know what he done to the camera, this green light down to the camera. He broke in and like, obviously no one is, no one was meant to be at the house. And um, Diana, and he says, Diana, what are you doing here? Then she picked up the phone, calling the police. Um, somebody's broken in, um, 999, somebody's broken in. And um, Monet comes out and, and with a gun and shoots him, boom, boom in the chest. I was like, oh yeah. my God. How the hell are they going to get away with this? But I was shocked. Like, I, I was shocked he went that early. No, this I is what I'm trying to say. I thought but, it lost at least probably towards the latter end of the, no, the series. But this is what's good about power. Something to take out people out randomly. Uh, Shoot, obviously, probably Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones. Uh, uh, exactly. Exactly. I, I was going to say it was not like as big as Game of Thrones, but it did take out people randomly. And I was quite, 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 quite frankly, I was quite happy for this guy to go because he's time. He had to go. <laughs> um, but I think I think Diana um, enjoyed punching her mum as part of the whole, whole part of the whole crime scene. I thought she was gonna go buck wild on her, you know, like okay, first punch. I didn't hurt too much. Then, then I thought she just like punching her in a craze, isn't it? But look, yeah, she probably don't have to. Any opportunity to punch your mum, bro? You take it, bro. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> No, nah, no, nah, mum, I know has to get called right now. I know, straight <laughs> up, straight <laughs> up. Nah, um, but what what was also interesting, um, they, um, Monet got, um, not not Cooper Sacks, what's his name? Red, not Red Man, Method Man. Davis. Davis, Davis. got yeah. him to um, go into the policeman's house. Yeah. And find on um, find paperwork, and what they did find was the fingerprints to what's her, what's her husband's name um lorenzo yeah oh yeah they found lorenzo's fingerprints at a crime scene where mecca was killed and yeah. obviously the paperwork was given to monet so monet's like what what lorenzo and it's 85 percent chance that's his fingerprints so she's like now clicking back to everything that kane's been doing and lorenzo not been saying anything and letting Kane run with shit. So, mm-hmm. and, and obviously Drew, from the last episode, Drew was kind of like, like, what's all this about Kane? Listen to Kane, Kane's in control. So now Monet's kind of like, she's putting two, 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 two and two together. And I think two and two together equals episode five. Lorenzo's going <laughs> to die. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> good mess there, man, good mess there. No, no, but honestly, um, I, I think I think this episode was probably I think it's probably one of the I think one of the best episodes so far. I I, I really really enjoyed it. I know yeah. I know Kel Marlon, you guys are not not into it as of yet, but yeah, it, it is 
it is it is kicking off. I can see. It. I've never seen Rich be so enthused about a series, you know, like no, this. No, no, but do you know, no, what? no, it's not a bad thing. I'm just, I've never seen this. Like, like usually you're just like one word here, one word there. But Merv hasn't said, Merv has said nothing. I'm, I'm listening to it all. Like, I feel like I'm actually, watching it, isn't it? Like, I'm saying, Rich is giving everything, it. boy. I'm not no, going to say the dry parts. To be fair, like no, yes, but, the Sullivan. <laughs> no, I'm coming to that in a minute. But yeah. you know what it is? Are you usually, finished? No, it's usually Nate MC and so for so long. Nate, <laughs> Nate takes his gl- Nate takes his glory, you know, power. Get out of here. <laughs> Thank God it's not here, by the way. <laughs> but anyway. So um, then we try to keep it clean for you today, but uh, everybody gets one way. We know the rules. Nah, and <laughs> and and Sullivan is still Sullivan, right? He doesn't trust anyone. Um there, there's a scene where Sullivan and his lady friend are in a bar, and Lady Friend has to take so a Sullivan phone. is the lady. Sullivan. Yeah, she's the lady. The, What's the, the guy's name? The one that Sachs, you mean? Sa- Cooper Sachs, sorry, sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Sullivan takes a phone call. Cooper Sachs is there. It sees another, it sees the other phone ringing. It's like, what phone is that? Like, this guy is a crook. Who takes a screenshot of the mobile number calling your someone else's phone? Boom. And hey, you know that number is Lauren, isn't it? Yeah. Hundred yeah. percent. That's that's Lauren. Oh, yeah, that's, for real, yeah. That's the other line. And obviously Lauren is trying to kind of like I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. So Cooper mm. Sachs eventually is going to call back this number and like call it and ring it and listen to the voice and say, who's this? And she's going to say, it's Lauren and put the phone down. It's going to happen. Lauren's going to be, obviously we know Lauren's alive. It's going to be big. Oh yeah. Big on episode five. Yeah, man. Right, Did I miss anything? Right. That's, that's no, you that's haven't. It. That's it. That's it, man. We just wrap power up, isn't it? <laughs> Yeah, so next episode, episode six, no, five, yeah. Episode, episode five. five. Friday, as oh, usual. That's powerful. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Um, powerful. Oh, yeah, that's powerful. That's yeah, powerful. Yeah, oh, yeah. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Speak up, my brother. Speak up. Yeah, that, up that was powerful, was Rich. Yeah, yeah, big up, man. Big up. Yeah. All right. Um, I don't know if you guys wanted to talk about... Did you watch Mandalorian? Are you up to date, Mandalorian? Yeah, yeah, I'm up to date. Yeah. Did you watch it as well, Lamar? I did, I did, I did. Yeah. Yeah, man. This episode has been a bit, a bit. Um, the fans about boy, like why, yeah. why though, why? Do, do you know what it is? I'll tell you why. Yeah, obviously, shockingly, we had um, Jack Black, Izzo, and Christopher Lloyd in it, and it just took it just took us out of Star Wars. Out of it, yeah, that's right. Like no, again, nothing against any of these actors in it, but they just didn't fit in Star Wars. Who, well, who, don't get me wrong. Lizzo, Jack Black, and Christopher Lloyd. I was just enjoying it at this point, man. You don't even notice these um, guests. Yeah, I, that's what I'm saying, yeah. bro. I, I'm just. I, you should, like, I feel like. Um, uh, what's you, you know who we're talking about, though, yeah? The, the actual actors, though. Nah. Lizzo. You know Lizzo, Lizzo is that. <laughs> how, do you, how do you describe Lizzo? He's that, um, that American artist that sings. Um, um, uh... It's quite heavy. <laughs> that that <laughs> song, man. The worst, you know. That song, um, Rich Man, you know the song, man. Yeah, anyway, no, anyway, look up Lizzo, isn't it? look up Lizzo, you're on time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what, the woman Lizzo? Jack, yeah. Jack Black is, is Jack, Jack Black is um, the voice of I, I, know, I, know Jack, I know Jack Black. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. I get, okay, that pick where they go to that, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's, like a, that, that's, like, a, that, that's like a Wizard of Oz place they went to, man. Like, yeah, it just, it just seemed really weird. Like, don't get me wrong, I know. I know I know you can probably um, have a bit of creative freedom when, when you're doing a TV series, and it's like you just probably want to have like a kind of funny episode sort of thing. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It just I, I just feel like I don't really want to see like famous Those, people in Star Wars yeah. not doing Star Wars things, didn't it? Like, I hear you. I hear you. Yeah. Like, like, we, like it, even like in Force Awakens, Daniel Craig was in that. And you would never know that until unless he was one of the stormtroopers, in it that was in. Um, Room with uh, Ray when she was, and she basically Jedi mind trick, in it. And I would have never known that was Daniel Craig. You know what I mean? But they're gonna be in it, be in it like that, in it. Just, just kind of end in the background. But yeah, yeah. yeah. They made Jack Black. He was Jack Black, if that makes sense. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It didn't change like, like he didn't like, change. He didn't act. Yeah, 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 in, yeah. In a costume, yeah. like the Lizzo thing. Oh, what is this? It's just weird. Like, <laughs> yeah, Doc, yeah. You, hell, you know who who we're talking about as well? Like Doc from Back to the Future. Yeah. Yeah, no, you, you, you know what it is? Because I've been watching, 
Clone Wars and um, Rebels, yeah. yeah. My, but my mind's all, I, I have to try and remember, okay, because Bad Lewis seems like I watched it ages ago. I'm trying yeah, to yeah, remember yeah. it, yeah. you know what I mean? But I yeah, know, I, right. I, I, remember, I remember you were talking about it now. Yeah. Like, even when, yeah. even when, um, like, I can't remember his name in the show, like, the doc, I'll just call him. Like, even when they, like, oh, yeah. found out that it was him doing all the, all every all the crap, basically. Even yeah. the Scooby-Doo, like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was, yeah, yeah, proper. If it wasn't for you meddling, like, what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Still no, good, right, though, was... don't get me wrong, it's still a brilliant show, just it kind of yeah. took me out of the whole universe for a little bit on that one. I didn't enjoy it. And, like, you see the way they gave um uh Bogotan. Bogotan back the black saber as well yeah. dark saber right dark yeah, saber. Started, um, already know. make them fight in it make them fight or something yeah are you seeing what i'm saying like, yeah. okay. they don't have to kill they don't have to kill each other just just fight for it innit? but yeah. i kind of wondered that because remember in, like the few episodes back when there was in the the rivers or wars of mandalore whatever yeah, like, yeah, that yeah. creature was like um is that is that is that their secret key, creature though is that like because you know they got like a that woman's oh, got the, like a, the an ornament, or, yeah, the ornament yeah. of it. No, the Mifflesaw was, um, you know, when she was swimming back up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah, I know. That, that was a Mifflesaw. That thing looked huge. Yeah, it looked massive, isn't it? Oh, so, wait, so, so, cause she's seen the Mifflesaw, does that is that why now she's given like this prey? She can take her mask off. She's still a Mandalorian. Yeah, I, I think the armor is. Line. I think the armor was like, yeah, you're like almost like she's a chosen, isn't it? Okay, another another show where they've switched it from the okay, cool. I'll just check it. No, 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 you can't say that, man. You can't no, say no, it. No, 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 I know we don't know how it's gonna go, but it's just fact, like, uh, but Bo has oh, been in there from no. since Clone Wars, bro. Oh, I, so know, she, I know, yeah, Clone Wars. She's, Clone Wars, she's yeah. always in fact she was she was leader of the Mandalorians, isn't it? Like, yeah, she was. I think she, she a, a was, sector, yeah, so. a sec I think a sector of, of the Mandalorians. Yeah, but but it, I, I it, prefer she is in she is in the show, but they have that thing where they don't have to wear their helmets, isn't it? Yeah, like she's still the leader of that, that clan. Yeah, and she, she, and she to be fair, in, in the animated series, she always took her mask off anyway. Her helmet. So she's yeah, consistent. She but yeah, yeah. saying that though, I prefer Jin, Jin to be like, like I like I like he's the kind of cowboy of the series, isn't it? It's like, yeah, you you claim your right as as the leader of Mandalores, and I'll just go and do my own thing. And that's that's how I want it to be, isn't it? I just want it to be the constant traveling wonder, isn't it? Like, uh, have, I, I, don't, many, I don't want him to. I don't want him to leave. Him. Yeah, how many episodes are there left? I don't know. You know. So I'm assuming there's eight in total. So one more left then. Oh, is it one more left? Oh, I so, yeah. oh wasn't that? Wasn't yeah. that? Oh, okay, I thought that was episode five. Sure. Yeah, oh, no, no, I thought, I'm sure it's seven. I like oh, those I... little creatures that own it. This I have spoken. <laughs> You imagine that having a meeting. Like I, lo I love it. I love after it. After everything yeah, you yeah. say, it, I have spoken. I have spoken. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Because um, everyone's talking, yeah. is, it, is it ignoring <laughs> who's talking to them first? Was it Boca Ted? I was trying to chat to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, just ignoring her, but just getting off their work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, yeah I, they I, they I had, had a bit of beef in it. Like she was yeah. trying to do it with a diplomat, but it's like, listen, look, 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 like, yeah, the long thing, isn't it? Because Din hates robots, isn't it? He don't, he don't like robots. The one yeah, done. yeah. The droids, I should say, he's just like a bit ruthless in them. But um, yeah, that was Mandalorian. Um, we got Mandalorian. Obviously, this is this is one. This is a conversation where everyone can join in. Obviously, it was the forty um, fifth anniversary of Superman the movie, nineteen seventy eight. Um, <laughs> yeah, that came out on Friday, and I think it was on Saturday as well. Um, did you did you go to cinema and watch it? Of course, I did, bro. Of course, I did. don't ask me them questions, you know. <laughs> Sorry, Merv. Quick question. Yeah. Yeah. What, what's the sig significance of 45th anniversary? Why not wait five years and be the 50th anniversary? Is there? Is there? I think they just do it every 10 years, mate. True. That's true. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's happened between like. It's weird. Like, weird. It's yeah. It came out true. in 1978. Why? Why? I don't. I don't know. I don't Maybe know. they do it every year. You know. I don't know. I don't know. But it's but, but like basically when I was on my cinema app, I'm just looking constantly like. When Superman the original movies gonna come out, and I saw it one day, I was like, "Yeah." And obviously, I, I'm a bit committed to the cause, isn't it? but um, yeah, I went to see it, bro. But let me tell you a story before I saw it. Yeah, so as I plan my day, yeah, it's Good Friday. I sacrifice doing everything. Yeah, got on the A13 now, come to a complete, stop. complete stop, and film started at seven thirty because I was going Westfield in it, Stratford. I'm sorry, at 7 30. I didn't get there till 5 to 8. Yeah. Oh, I was sweating, I was swearing in the car. I can imagine. I was angry. 
I said, why, why would you do this to me now? Why now? All days, of all yeah, days. Yeah, yeah. Like, this is my journey. I, I, I listened in good, in good time. But, bro, I, I ran. I, was li- I ran up the escalators, bro. <laughs> the rest of it. Get the way. Like, <laughs> <and> then, <laughs> as, soon as, I, as soon as I opened the door, all I heard was, yes, I just made, I just made oh, it. I just made it. You know, if I missed that S coming to the screen, it would have been void, innit? I would have walked out. Straight. Oh. Great. Yeah. So the, the screen was tiny. It was like, it's like, it was like, proper like, oh, it's a bit, a bit of a tiny screen, innit? But, but yeah, that's the first time I've ever seen it in, in, in cinema, innit? So I was, I was emotional. But... Well, was it packed? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they show, like, um, did they show a special edition, like the Richard Donner original? No. So it, it was the, it was the original theatrical release. So like there was parts of it that were just missing, like because I, like I, I, I always when I watch it, I always watch the the full edit. Yeah, yeah, and I was watching, I thinking, no, are you supposed to do that? Or you like don't get me wrong, certain bits of it, like you know when he's running up, when he's running, running along the train, yeah, and then the little girl goes, "Mom, mom, mom," and then like mom's like, "Lois Lane, you do have a yeah, 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 yeah. dad." I didn't like that part because I'm like, first of all. Mark's like you big teenager, yeah, yeah. They're, they're 18, and she's like nine years, eight years old or something. So that was just stupid, do you know what I mean? But um, the rest of it, like, no, nah, glorious, man. Bro, you like, know what I don't understand? Why they cut out the bit? You know when he goes down to... Um, Lex Luthor. Lex Luthor's layer, and they do... Yeah, and, they, and they they they're shooting him up. They yeah, him, yeah. Freeze it. And why they froze him. Why would that not be... Yeah, that, that was really... In fact, when you watch it, when you watch it as the theatrical release, it looks so badly edited, you know. Yeah. Because it goes down, and all of a sudden, it's like, oh, it's coming, Mister Lou Ford. Yeah, he's like, yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, like now that because I'm so used to the, the to the full version, everything I saw in that one, I'm like, no, nah, you probably missed out pure bits, man. Like even when he when he first met Lois in the Daily Planet, Clark, he sat like, and she showed she showed, it, she showed him in his seat, in it. He sat mm-hmm. down, and he just. I stared at her afterwards, and they cut that bit out. So I'm like, these are significant moments. Man. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? But like, it's just as good, man. Like, obviously, there's just some funny parts. In it. Like, you know when um, they're doing the missile thing, swapping the um, numbers over, and I think yeah. Lex Luthor, Otis, and Miss Miss um, I can't remember the name, Pass- Pass- whatever. Pass- yeah, Tessa, Miss Passwalker. Yeah, she um like. I think obviously the first thing they they messed up in it, but it's messed up. But like literally the next scene, they got completely different outfits on, completely different vehicle. I'm like, this is actually all in the same moment, you know. So let's say they went back the next day. This is the same moment because Otis has still got the black eye in it. So things like that, I'm like, yeah, that was a bit silly. But and and obviously him him turning the world back around when Norris died. Yeah, that, that was just a little too much. Like. In the context of a film being made in 1978, for, for what it was, the film, like, no Superman film was being it, in my opinion. Yeah, I kind of agree. As I got older, I started to prefer the movie than all the others. Yeah. Bro, and just a dual identity. The thing is about, like, comic book movies these days, everyone's just like, yeah, hi, hi, I'm Clark Kent, and I'm also Superman. Like, they just, they just like, give their identity away straight away. There's no... There's no mystery. There's no fun or excitement about them. That's like, true. That's true. Like it's just yeah. yeah. Everyone, everyone. It kind of works in MCU, like, but like with Superman, I'm like, like with, with the Henry Cavill one, I, I didn't see any difference in their in their dual identity in it. It was just the same person. Come on, if you walk past this guy, you know, that, right? That's Clark Kent. Looks like Mad look, looks like Superman. Like, that's Probably, like, like yeah, even the Christopher Reeve who's all hunched, he's, he's hunched over. He's, oh come on. Yeah, Remember that bit where he the glass up Lois? Yeah, there's like Lois. There's, like, he just stood up like oh. a freaking... Instantly changed, you know? Instantly. Oh. Voice changed, everything. Everything. Yeah. yeah. He, he smashed it, bro. He's so subtle as well. Like, as Superman, he's so subtle as well. Like, even him jumping off the, the roof and like, the ledge when he meets Lois for the first time, like, as, as Superman, it's like... Yeah, he, he smashed it, bro. I'm going to lie. So I know we're hopping on the Superman film. Yeah. But I, I even... I kind of prefer the Donna cut, the one we're talking about. You know when... Yeah, yeah. Um, she starts to clock that he's Superman. She starts um, drawing in the newspaper. Like she puts her yeah, hat that, on. Yeah. And then he does, Superman uses, is it Superman 2? Yeah. And yeah, he uses Superman's super on speed, the cut, yeah. He uses super yeah. speed rather than flying to Paris. And I don't know, just the Richard Donner <laughs> yeah, stuff was just, a, it was just better. I yeah, don't know. That, that, yeah, definitely, definitely. 
Yeah. Rest in, like, rest in peace a lot of them, boy. A lot of that cast. Even like, yeah, even Marlon Brando as Gerald. I was watching, I think, you know what? I could actually watch a whole film with him just being Gerald in it, you know? Like, if they'd done a, 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 a script on prequel, obviously they got to him. Like, even the, what, 10 minutes was in the film for? Smashed it, bro. Yeah, man. Alan, oh. Alan, Alan, that's his name. <laughs> yeah, do you, do you guys do you do remember the film where you're just like, have you no, seen, no, have you seen uh, the um the cut we're talking about like with all the extra stuff in that you got? Yeah, that, that's, that's the Superman I, two. You need, to, you need to, you need to. Yeah, I I have, but it was a very long time ago. I'm being really honest with you. Really stop lying. You have it. No, I have, I have. No what the Richard Donner cut? That that one did come out till like mid. Thousands or something. Like I said, it's a very long. Two thousand twenty-three. <laughs> hey, Merv, you know the um spinning around the whole spinning around the Earth thing. Yeah. You no, know that was initially supposed to happen at the end of Superman two. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 why are you see, that, see, that's the thing. And yeah, there's a lot of Russian things. It's like Lois shouldn't have died straight away like that. The, the film was. She just should too... always die. Nah, no, no, that Lois. That <laughs> Lois. She's annoying now, but back then, no, nah, Lois. Yeah, was... that Lois. No, nah, you know, for some respect, that Lois was good, man. They probably had they probably had chemistry. That's the thing. You know what? Something you guys are pretty yeah. sad. Do you know that? Wow, well, well, like, you guys are pretty sad. This. Look, you guys are, this. You guys are like I literally. I enjoy pre- She Hulk. Listen, you guys, you guys, you guys are more or less pre coming <laughs> over. A, a Superman was forty five years. Forty five years ago, bro. bro why not, bro? Why here, not, bro? Come on, bro. chest as well. Look, get power. get over it. Get over it. The thing is, you got negativity to say, but you can't name me one better film than that Superman movie. Well. Maybe apart from like end games. Come and on, come on, you know what you're going to say, Splash. The, re- the rest of it, you can't really say anything else, really. Splash, bro. That's a splash. Uh, I wasn't referring to Splash. It's totally no, different no levels. <laughs> definitely different <laughs> levels. And Splash was a unique, unique film. Well, it's not the same 90s. category. It's not the same category. But, but I didn't mention it. It was he. I'll, I'll wait. I'll wait for you to like you know maybe after the product but, at some point. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You can't. You can't do that. That whole. Say the say you mention you say you bet you can't mention the film apart from these films. Then say I'll wait for you after the pod to mention the film. You really took my films away. So there you go. You can't do that. How can you do that? That doesn't make no, no sense. Well, most of, oh, which which yeah. say, say, <laughs> which say Matrix? Say Matrix. No, I'm not saying Matrix. No, I'm not, even, not even Matrix, bro. Matrix is big. Don't get me wrong. I'm not even Matrix. But anyway, I'll, I'll, I'll wait for your feedback anyway. No, but if you, you've took you know my feedback. You've took it away, digest. But the thing you still haven't you have an opportunity to say, it, but you haven't said anything. You've just mentioned my films already. Digest it. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, no. you, you, you know the Eminem thing. You, you, you know he dissing himself, isn't it? Dissing himself, and you can't go. You can't. I can't come back. You just said no, what no, I was no. going to say. But anyway, no, look, look, I respect. Big, big, up, big, really big up, 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 yeah, and big yeah. up Batman while you're there. Yes, Kel. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we move. All right. Um, yeah, quickly before we round up. So <laughs> I, I'm the only one that watched um, Super Mario Brothers here, right? Yeah. yeah. So I haven't touched it yet. It's oh. good. It's good film. It's good film. I don't think it's going to... Like, you know, like, we just anticipate to be one of the best video game adaptations or movies of the year. Yeah, I don't think it's going to get there. But... Um, <laughs> Where's <laughs> <laughs> Ruji there? He's so he drops it, you know. Back in, man, boy, it up to bring it down, you know. Oh, but it was, God. it was good. It was enjoyable. Like I, I, I prefer it better than Sonic. That's for sure. Both Sonics as well. Yeah. No, it's, it's, well, stop, well, I'm, pre- I'm pretty sure it's gonna Sonic make down. some. No, 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 no. I'm pretty sure it's gonna make some big mm-hmm. money, and then there's obviously gonna be definitely say go and take the kids, take yourselves, watch it in there. No, yeah, that's a good film. I, I, I'll do it. Too. I'll take it. Watch it tomorrow. Yeah, definitely. Um, and can somebody watch Shazam, please? No, I what? Because I watch it not tonight. Tomorrow. I started watching it yesterday. I thought shit, the miss is gonna kill me because she wants to watch it as well. So I, and she's she's in the kitchen in it, and she popped her head through. What are you watching? No, I just see if it's clear. <laughs> I just see if it's clear or not. Don't worry, you really watch twenty five minutes. Of it. <laughs> <Get me. laughs> well, you watch it, man. No. <laughs> like, like you might, I want to laugh, bro. Just, it's, it's so dumb. I'm not you, even going to wait. You've seen it. You've seen it. I'm not going to watch it. I'm going to turn it in. I'm just going to wait until it comes on 
I'm not, I'm not, I'm not rushing to see it. But I no, watched it's crystal on, clear, I watched it on it's alternative. Clear. It doesn't matter, bro. I'm just, I'm what, just what, not giving what, my what, energy for time. What was that, Mark? Ma? What did you watch it on? Alternatives, man. No, which one? Because I, I watched it on Oh, my no, 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 no. On my TV. On my TV. Um, on my app. On the Fire Stick. Okay. Good copy, yeah? Perfect. Perfect. Mine was yeah. all time called, but I, 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 I persevered. <laughs> <laughs> it was good. I wouldn't have watched it. I would have been like, nah, I'm not watching this on that, but... Oh, good. No, the picture, it, it does make a difference, though, man. It does make a difference. Yeah. So right, I know, we're... Yeah, go on. I know it's a bit controversial, guys, and you probably should have caught it in a weekly roundup. But what's your man's opinion on Jonathan Majors, man? Because, like, he could be <laughs> dropped from Mar- from Marvel and stuff now. Oh, nah, nah, oh, oh yeah, yeah, the allegation. Uh, yeah, uh, they already. They, she already came out and said that she's mentally disturbed and all that, and it never happened. But there, it's still, it's still a mark on his name. It's still good, Bob. That his his <laughs> campaign dropped him. Yeah, all that kind of Not stuff. Like that, really. You're guilty. He was supposed to do some talk somewhere, in it? Like, yeah, everything, bro. People just because though she came out, you could tell she's been paid. Like that's what everyone's saying. Mm-hmm. The way she came out and what she said, they could tell that she, she's been paid some money to shut up. So what? You know what I mean? Same way you believed her when she came out and said he hit you. Well, believe her now. She said no. Nah. Yeah. Oh no, I'm with you, Miles. I'm, no, no, I'm, no, I'm, no, I'm not saying that. Yeah. 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 I'm just saying that like, it don't make sense. Yeah. Hmm. I, I hope because he's what he was. What he was. He was a, a shady light coming through. Do you know what I mean? And yeah. Yeah, it's just sad to see, man. I hope he didn't yeah. do that. I don't personally believe he would do that. Just coming into the limelight and putting get me. the whole yeah. future in jeopardy like that straight away. I mean, that's... Nah, I don't... I don't well, apparently, it's, it's the back of a taxi and it's all on camera, apparently, somewhere. So, we'll, we'll come on, on on YouTube soon or Instagram, <laughs> Twitter, yeah. whatever, man. Hmm. But yeah, sorry, go on, go on, man. Yeah, not saying anyone else watching anything else. Um, I know you guys are talking about beef series on that. Oh yeah, beef. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I guess that's one to I, I started it. But, um... Yeah, I, personally, me, I've just watched one episode. Um, that was rubbish. Isn't it? No, no, no it, it, it's all right. It's just, it's just interesting. I'm like, okay, cool. What's going on? And you see some guy. I'm not, if no one's watched it, I'm. There's no point. There's no point. That's, that's no Glenn point. from. Um, yeah, yeah, Walking, Walking Dead. Dead. And I was watching. I was oh, like, this guy, I know what this face. No, yeah. Um, the the is he? I want to say Filipino. No, South yeah, Korea, he is. Well, no, okay, well, in the character is Philippine. Then. Okay. Oh, is it? Let me double check this in case. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I don't, I've watched two episodes. I'm on the third one. That's what I was watching when you was like, what's that noise? I'm not sure yet. It's a bit, I don't know. It's almost, it's intriguing, but it's kind of like, it's a little childish, like the whole. It's, get, it's getting good reviews, but I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I heard so. All I know, man, lost 20 grand on, on, on Coinbase, bro. On Coinbase. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. I was like, I'm busting up. I was like, look, <laughs> that there, I would literally vomit quickly. Vomit quickly. <laughs> Straight. <laughs> Projectile as well. <laughs> Interesting. I'll, get, I'm, no. I'll watch a couple. I'll see how I go with it. See how I feel. But, yeah. yeah, South Korea. South Korea. Yeah. I so, watched them. Um, I started that Power, the Power on Amazon. Oh yeah, is that in, is that any yeah. good? Yeah, it's, it's it's good, you know. It's interesting. Yeah, the missus watched it. She loved I, it. I don't, I don't know, but I don't know if Arnold should watch it. But yeah. <laughs> 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 <Love his behavior today, laughs> but, yeah. Already know. See, so from you said that, I already bit, know. Him. It's a bit too female based for you, bro. Yeah, <laughs> stay away from it. It's proper yeah. female empowerment. Proper. <laughs> 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 I mean, there's nothing wrong with some female empowerment. I'm just saying. Though. Yeah, this, but this oh, was not oh, just oh, this. Oh. This was not some. This is that only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> only, they're the only ones that hold the powers, bro. Yeah, don't watch it, man. Yeah. I'll come after you, bro. <laughs> and you know, you know, I finally watched as well um, Halo. Like, I just Halo. finished the oh, whole season shit. of the game. Yeah, I just it on the whole day, bro. Like, I forgot about that show, you know. It was good to imagine, though, because I've never played the game, so I know nothing to compare it to. Yeah, it, same know? here. Same here. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Like, yeah. Who's um, in Halo? Um, he's a, he's a known actor. I, can't, I don't know. But yeah, he's, when you see him, you'd be like, oh, him. Yeah, yeah. He, I, I, what was he in, man? He was in something. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Man. But the thing is, I don't know if in the game they take if they take their helmets off. Because I thought it was like, I don't yeah. like stuff like that when they don't take their helmet off. Because I'm intrigued yeah. by their character. But how they can move without, you know, think, but no, it's, it's, it's interesting. It's, the story's very basic, isn't it? Quite predictable. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's... Yeah. 
this is easy to follow as well, man. I was oh, yeah, he's, that's it. He's the Irish guy, the American gods, isn't it? But I don't think Rich watched Yeah, that. yeah, yes, yes. That's right, yeah. No, I don't. Um, yeah. And obviously, I watched that. I don't know if, you, um, if you're watching Succession, Kel, but you need to get on that, man. Have, that? have you got Succession? I'm sure you watched Succession. Oh, no, I know, yeah, no, let's get on it. Yeah, yeah I'll get on it. Yeah. yeah. You know what? I, I, I'm, Star, I'm Star Wars right now, man. <laughs> I just, I just put Star Wars to the side and come back to... <laughs> yeah. What was you going to say, Rich? No, no, Succession. Everyone's been talking about it. I heard it's, heard yeah. it's really, really good. Yeah, no, say it, no more, it's, say no more. It's, it's I, really yeah. good. I might have to post about it, but I'm like, no, this is too, too risky to post. I didn't post about it, but I'm like, just say no more, say no more. Do you know what? Right. You, know what yeah. you know what? You know what I've been watching? Uh, I, don't ask me why I've done this. I've gone... I've, I've started Snowfall all again, bro. Why? Because I'd never finished it. And I'm like... Oh, like, thought, oh, like all your other shows. It's a, bit, it's a bit harsh, isn't it? Well, not harsh. But anyway, I, 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 I uh, keep it down. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I just um, finished season one and I absolutely loved it. Absolutely. Yeah, no, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm on the last season. It's big. The last season is big as well. And the thing is, I thought they were all still on, on the BBC. And I realised... And um, um, Disney have taken from episode one to one to six, one to five, or one to six episodes or season, season. So all the seasons are all on Disney now. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Serious. Yeah, all, yeah, all of, it's all on Disney. Oh, bro, 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 I've been watching alternatives all this time. <laughs> yeah, it's all on Disney. Bro. Listen, well, the, the latest before season you watch well. something, before season, you watch bro. something, check nah. Disney first, bro. Disney, Disney. Nah. The mouse owns everything, bro. Yes, it's, on, it's, on, it's, it's deep as on Disney because I went to because I knew it was in BBC and BBC have lost. There's no season one, two, or three. There's, there's only season four, and I thought, what, what that doesn't make sense. I thought, what nonsense is this? And I went to Disney. I don't know why I was checking, looking at Disney, and I thought, I thought there must be someone chucking my cookies, whatever. And I saw um, Snowfall, and I thought, rah. I checked in and all the seasons are all there and I thought oh man okay doing? cool alright cool no more struggling right. no, it's not really a struggle but you have to search and blah blah no that's good man alright cool yeah it, it's there so I'm I'm, in, I'm engrossed in that at the moment um, oh, yeah stuff was big man yeah it is big it is yeah. big well, one more thing I was going to say as well Carl, to be, to be, I, watched, I, I told you I watched 1883 isn't it yeah you told me yeah, but, yeah, but and, I watched, and, hey, and then I watched nine. no no not, that's 1899 yeah you watched that 18... Yeah, I, I quit that one. I quit 1899. Yeah. But 1883 is the pre pre prequel to Yellowstone. Yeah, Yellowstone, yeah. And then I watched 1923 as well. And that, that was good too. Does does it does do they could like Yeah, yeah, like you you proper ah ah, ah all right, like, so I right, just ask yeah. this question. You remember I was saying I was moaning that how the only thing about Yellowstone, a couple this is a massive branch, yeah. Yeah. Like where are the cousins, where are the uncles, where are the aunties? Is that explained in, in, in any of them? Pretty much. Well, okay. I don't know if they're going to do a sequel to 1923. Not yeah. a sequel, I mean like a season yeah, two. Yeah, or yeah, even yeah. just do a completely different, like, I don't know, 1990 or something. But yeah, I, they haven't explained it as such. But I can see, if I'm following the things correctly, I can see why there's not a lot of them there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, man. If there's nothing else going on. It's, uh, I'm doing episode 185. Come on. Comment, like, subscribe, do all that stuff. Come on. Big up, people. And all that. No yeah. more, no yeah. more likes, please. No I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> keep them up, man. We're, we're enjoying this, man, and keep yeah. up the conversation as well. I like it. We're, we're loving it. We're loving it. Yeah. Big up. Big up. Yeah. Yeah. Man. But anyway, for next week, gents. Big up. Love Peace. You. Peace.